Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for June 19th and 20th, Wednesday and Thursday, for my Tauruses. Hello, my Tauruses. How are you? I hope you're doing great. Okay, short reading, and it's Wednesday, Thursday, so I use my Bradley Valentine Archangel Power Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest. That full moon energy is still out there. You know, June 17th, Sagittarius, hopeful, hopeful, optimistic. A lot of things they're talking about, you know, that this is, you know, I'm hearing that this is kind of a changing type of, you know, moon also. So get out there. Release, relinquish, and request. Now, one card has popped out of the deck. Let's go ahead and cut for two more. So the first and third card are reversed. So it means, hey, pay attention. Oh, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Okay, first card, two of Raphael, or Raphael. Now, in this, in this deck, Raphael represents water energy, or cups, okay, in traditional tarot. So this is very emotional, very fluid. This is, you know, this is about love. This is about love. Now, I am, you know, relationships to me, work, personal, or family. So, you know, what is it that you love? What is, what are you searching for, too? So this, to me, it means that, you know, something, something's happening with that. You're, you're opening your, you're being more receptive to it. You're opening yourself up to it. Maybe, maybe you were out in that full moon saying, hey, I want some, I want something to love. I want someone to love. I want a job to love. I want, you know, this is what it is. And it's okay to ask that. People get kind of, they're surprised when I say, get out there and ask. If you don't, the answer is always no. But this I'm feeling for many of my Tauruses, and I hope that it's you, that this is like, this is a wonderful, loving, like, relationship. And if it is work, I want that to be for you. If it is a, you know, interpersonal, yes. Family, yes. Two hearts dedicated to creating something wonderful. Kindred spirits, don't give up on those you love. I really feel very strongly with that card for you, my Tauruses, so. Okay. Four of Gabriel. Now, Again, in this deck, Gabriel is representing the fire energy, passionate energy, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius energy. You know, now we're going to be going into Cancer season, and then right after that's Leo season. But this is about, you know, this is about whatever this is, whatever this love thing was, work, whatever. It's like the time to celebrate, time to rejoice. It's it's a coming, it's a, it came, it's here, it's right there. You feel the energy in the air, you know? I'm thinking that you feel the energy in the air and you're like, I'm going for something that maybe, you know, maybe you're not normally, that you normally don't go for, um, you know, but it's I feel that there's movement and it's kind of an exciting time for you too. So, you know, and we do have, what is it, the um, summer equinoxes also. So th there's this ch this switch over. I feel all of these energies are affecting you, my Tauruses. Time for celebration. Abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burdensome situations. So maybe it's even just, maybe this is a love of life because you just got rid of something, okay? But when you get rid of something, it means you're going towards something. I'm not saying, oh, I broke up with this person to go, you know, because I'm now engaged to this person. No, it, but it could be I left this job because I did, I'm starting a new job, okay? Or it could be the other one. Maybe you did break up with somebody to go to somebody else. Usually you need a little downtime for that, but that's okay. No judgment here, right? No judgment. Okay, last card, and this one is also reverse, so powerful. The Ace of Raphael. Okay, again, again, that fluid, that love, that that ener that emotional energy. Aces are about new beginnings, new beginnings for you. So this one is a positive new emotional experience. And again, any of this could be, you know, like I said, relationship, work, personal, family. All of those things fall into a uh, relationship. Now, it could be a relationship that you, you know, that you feel strongly about, or, and I will warn you on this, you know, you might be somebody, you might be, and I'm going to use this as an example, you might be a workaholic, 
and the universe thinks that you know that you need a little bit more family time or personal time and they throw a little bit of a monkey wrench into it so just be aware of that so it might be what the universe thinks you need too but a positive new emotional experience fulfilling romantic relationships deep and lasting spiritual insight so you know that to me my taurus is when i read that there's a taurus out there that it's like and please 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 always do your due diligence okay when i say this take this with some grains of salt okay but it's like you know you have this spiritual connection you have this insight and it's like all of a sudden things start falling into place and it's like you know you know now i don't want anyone to meet somebody and then fly you know somebody tomorrow and then fly out to vegas you know the next day because debbie said i'll know no 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 you always you know but but i'm talking to my doruses so you know, I mean, you're very, you can be very grounded. So I, I won't, I don't necessarily have to worry about you, but it is like, it's like all of a sudden the energies are saying, you know, are, are all around you, very positive, very loving, very kind energies. So I'm going to, I'm going to just say this is a win-win for my Tauruses and I like it. I like it a lot. So my Tauruses, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.